Remember that when you're looking for a job, you need to tailor your resume for every single job you apply for. Why? For every job you see on the internet, three or four hundred people may apply for that job. Do you think hiring managers and recruiters open three or four hundred resumes and read them to fill one job? Chances are no human being will ever gaze upon it. Think about what you're doing now, where you want to be 10 years, where do you want to be, what do you want to do? And then start thinking about a plan to get you from where you are now to where you want to be. When somebody comes to us looking for a job, is we figure out what their situation is. What kind of job do you want? What kind of education do you have? We do a gap analysis to figure out what it is step by step that you need to do between now and then. Help you with your resume. We'll talk about some job search tips and techniques, how to network, and how to work a job fair. Job resources, there's a million of them out on the net. In fact, there's so many. That's one of my big jobs, is to kind of cut through the weeds and point you to where you want to go. And they'll give each one about a one minute initial glance. In that one minute, they're looking for three basic things. First. Does this person meet the minimum qualifications for the job? But just keep in mind that when you're applying for a job, it's better to spend all day tailoring a resume for that job than it is to click submit 10 times on some job search website with just your base resume. They're going to start off liking you a lot. A lot of them that I've showed this resume to, this format, say, I probably wouldn't even read the rest of it right now, right then. I'd probably just put it in the pile to call for an interview.